Today, I'll be concluding the first season of Sam Lemkin. It's kind of a sad day, however, a little rain comes a little sunshine, am I right? I don't applause when I say that. It's Sam Blemkamp, hey guys. So uh, today you'll be seeing the first official uh, Honor Guard boot camp. I'm gonna put these new boys to the work. Uh, let's see how strong they are. All right, drop them to me 20 right now. Push How are they doing? This is a disgrace. Are you ready for big boy crown? Yes. Yes. Yes, I am. Oh, okay. I am so excited. How's the food this year? Um, it's delicious. I haven't yet to taste it, but let's find out. Let's start with the salad. It tastes like salad. I give it a thumbs and a half up. Let's dig into uh, my little taco right here. I kind of overfilled it, but that's okay. I'm a big boy. Big boy season never ends until you uh, until you see the light at the tunnel. It's missing one thing, track sauce. Hey guys, welcome back to another legit interview. Today I'll be interviewing the future colonel of Legacy's dance program, Miss Clark Rogers. We'll start really nice and easy. Two plus two. Four. All right, now who's the cutest guard? There's only one right answer. It's okay to say. None of the above, because they're all brothers to me. Close enough. How high do you think you can kick? Well, I can keep my hat with my left, but not right. All right, so you can keep so your... So almost 1-8. Like, that'd 1 be like 1 -8. Okay, I heard you were supposed to go on a date with Carson Bro. Uh, what happened to that? Uh, he's dipped me up. Wait, wait, let's go to Carson. Let's go to Carson. Oh my god, I'm so glad that you are here. We are here with Mr. Carson Bro. Hold on one second, Isabel. We're in the middle of an interview. Thank you. This is chaotic. Hey, wait. This is what happens on Zambulam Camp. Okay, Zambulam Camp is where you on today's episode of Second Chance, Parker's gonna give Carson a second chance. Carson, you have 10 seconds to explain why you stood Miss Parker Rogers up. Sweetie, you know I never meant to do anything. I really don't remember standing you up, honestly. I remember having a great time that night, and I really hope that you do too, because I, I, it's something I'll never forget. I'm tired of your lying. Stay. Stay. No. This is not stage. Being smart, being funny, being extremely attractive, being punctual, extremely funny, extremely attractive, but more than all of that, being responsible. And as such, the charm we got her will arrive at two to five business. The charm that will be coming very shortly is a little fire charm, and that represents uh, how destructive we are. And uh, we're putting paint in the microwave. Yeah! But it also hopefully brightens up your day a little bit because every time you look at it, you can also remember how hopefully funny, attractive, <laughs> and uh, responsible we were. I know that you have a personal life of three very wonderful children, and it's got to be amazing to come to school and have to deal with eight more. Uh, <laughs> I don't have a speech prepared, but I have my guitar. I will play some Dwight Yoakam songs. 50 of my closest friends. And girlfriends. <laughs> and shouldn't be girlfriends. Um, I'll send y'all a few texts after this. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I'm good. Action? Action. Are we rolling? We're rolling. I actually. And go. Three, two, one. One, two, three. I'm here with Chad Herrera. What's up? What's your name? Chad. You never officially oh. answered my question. I believe you said oh no, but God. there's only one right answer. Can I call you Poppy? You know what? Why not? Yeah! Puppy. Okay, but <laughs> uh, I'm with Brandon Rock, also known as White Yokum fan number 89. Yes. Um, so I'll be asking you a few questions, so you know the ritual, the usual. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's your favorite Dwight Yokum song? Favorite Dwight Yokum song would probably be um, She, she wore, wore Red Dresses. Red I've been oh dying to ask this. How big are your t-shirts? Oh, uh, <laughs> I wear a medium adult. I'm calling in Carson. Carson Bro is Carson. Carson Bro! Here, Carson Bro, come on in. Oh! Okay, oh. so Carson Bro, I'm gonna start off with some easy questions. You know the drill. Okay. Uh, so, what is your favorite color? Purple. Who is your favorite legacy? Second favorite legacy. My second favorite would have to be. Lauren Nestor. Oh, special guest. Are you wrong? Hello, I am with. 
Polly Lyons. Uh, the greatest dance director of all time. Uh, I'll start off with a little easy question. What is your favorite color? Blue. And uh, one last easy question. Who's your favorite child? <laughs> favorite guard? Vince Duff. All right, we're done. We're perfect. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Today, we will be interviewing. Oh, I messed up. Next, we are interviewing Nicholas Evans. Come on down. Nick, come on down. I'm sitting. Come on down. Just ask the questions. Never. What's your favorite color? Purple. Hey. Go ahead, come over there. I'll come over there. Thank you. <laughs> Who's your favorite guard? Uh, definitely Nicholas Evans. I, that, that was shocking. What is your favorite note to play on your instrument that you play uh, in band? Uh, high C. I can't hit it, but I mean, it's pretty fun when I do. Mm -hmm. Who is... And thank you, Nick, for coming on the show. No, I couldn't think of a button. Nick, okay, I have it, I have it, I have it, I have it, I have it. No, come over here. Okay. So Nick, oh, this is gonna yeah. be a little callback from last you know, two episodes ago. It may not be now. football season. Oh, however, I swear hey, hey, to ask. Set. This is my set. I don't get paid to babysit. You're really ruffling my feathers right now. I'm the star. Final question. Throwback to football season. It may not be football season. However, I've always been dying to ask you this. Who is your football daddy? My football daddy. Well, um, you may not. He's been there with me from the very beginning. And really, he just. He's been there for a Oh, no! This concludes the season finale of Zan Blam Camp. Thank you guys for tuning in. And, uh, just want to give a huge shout out to all my fans out there. Uh, I want to thank. God and Jesus. I want to thank my parents, and not only my parents, but my mom and dad. I would also like to thank my sister Jill and Lauren and Rachel. Lastly, thank y'all so much, and I'll see you guys oh. next season. Ah! Favorite guard that is interviewing you. <laughs>